Are you going after Emin? Anton! Let's go, Celine. Just come with me. Forget about Emma and Celine. I love you, Celine. You know that. I would never hurt you, even though you betrayed me. That's enough, Anton. Let's end this, please. It's over. It'll only be over once you're mine, Celine. We can't bring back things to the way they were before. What about everything we've been through? Do you really think I'd let Emin have you that easily? Huh? You won't get away from me now, Celine. You belong to me. You love me, don't you? You know I do. You know I did love you back then. But a lot has happened since then, Anton, and now I only want one thing, and that's to find out what really happened to my son. I want to know what you did to him and the reason why you did it. I already told you, Celine. I absolutely have no idea about what happened to Robbie. I just can no longer believe what you're saying, Anton. Do you really think I'm a criminal? I do. You and your entire family. Does it even matter if my family knows, Celine? I only want one thing right now. Only one. I want you to come with me. Don't come near me. Don't you want this? Huh? Don't you want this? Even after what you've done, even after you've betrayed me, I will still accept you. Just stay back. Uh, Colonel. Mr. Nick. Um, I'm... I'm eternally grateful to you for saving our hides back there. Agreed, Colonel. I really thought the officers who were following us were there to kill us. <laughs> You're in our jurisdiction now. We won't let that happen to the both of you. We're going to protect you, and we will do everything we can. Thank you so much again, Colonel. However, we can't deny the fact that you can still face charges for what you did. Huh? What? We... Is it because we were helping out Emmon? Obstruction of justice, Mr. Nick. You're also accomplices to a crime. You were also helping Emin out, who is still being considered as a fugitive and a wanted man. <laughs> just hold on, just... So you're saying Emin's a criminal and we're his accomplices? <laughs> we only wanted to help Celine out. Unfortunately, what the two of you and Emin did was really against the law. He will be charged for kidnapping and torturing Mr. Anton Hernandez. To be honest, even before what happened today, when Emman kidnapped Anton and attempted murder, a lot of crimes can already be made against Emman. Even if the real criminal here is Anton, he's the one who should be locked up for... <laughs> that has yet to be proven in court, Galoy. It's not that I don't believe that Anton is a criminal, but that's what the law says. It requires evidence and a court hearing. We need to follow due process before he can be convicted of his crimes. But... It was Anton's private army that attacked us earlier. Is that even legal? I give you my word, Mr. Nick. Everything that the Hernandezes did that violated the laws of this country, they will surely answer for. For now, rest assured that you are under my jurisdiction. You are under my protection. Thank you, sir. But I honestly still can help but to worry for myself. I'm a father too. So now who's going to protect Emin? All right. Are you sure you want to do this? You're gonna kill me? Why shouldn't I? 
You managed to destroy both my son's life and mine. Why shouldn't I get revenge on you and your family? My answer is yes, I can kill you right now! You have nothing on me! Everything is from Emmons' imagination. He had been poisoning your mind and you just allowed him to do that to you! <laughs> You're unbelievable, Celine. Despite everything you know about me and my family, you still went through with a wedding, huh? You sure have no conscience. It's you who has no conscience. You and your family, you're all despicable and heartless. Celine, hurry! You stay here. Help the boss. All right. 